I became a, an active Democrat after 1948. It was clear to me that the Democrats pulled together and uh, had come up with a, a program. How has being a progressive Democrat changed over the course of your career? When I started out, one of the big issues was fair housing. Okay. By fair housing, uh, the question is, should a landlord be required to, to rent to a, a black person? African American. And so the, the, the issues develop and, uh, and the, the times change and the issues change. Is there anything that stays constant? Change. <laughs> change is the only constant thing that I know of. And people who take the, the reactionary conservative viewpoint that they're satisfied with the way things are and they don't want to change, they maybe have their, their health and their money and their family and they Everything's going good for them. They don't want to change. They tend to be conservative. But uh, society changes, and uh, situations change. And as we have a, a greater, uh, greater uh, involvement of different groups and people, uh, uh, we, we see a great, a great change. For instance, uh, I've said this before. When uh, I joined the Senate in 1962, there had never been a woman senator. There had never been an African-American senator. There'd never been anything but white male senators. Now, one third of the Senate is women. Uh, the, the leader of the Democratic Party in the Senate is a woman. Our caucus is 50% women, 50% men. Uh, we have African Americans. Uh, it's, so it's, it's changed, and uh, for the good in that respect. So uh, things do change, and society changes, and, and uh, <clears throat> we're going to see many, many changes uh, develop the future.